लक होता तो है पर लक के लिए बड़ी मेहनत करनी पड़ती है लक भी ऐसे ही नहीं मिल जाता सो so, अ साइंटिस्ट और एन एक्सप्लोरर डिस्कवर्स समथिंग एंड सक्सीड्स ऑन द टेन थाउजेंड अटेम्प्ट यू नो हु आई एम टॉकिंग अबाउट अबाउट हु एडिसन एंड इफ यू हैव नॉट लुकड एट हिज एंटायर जर्नी इफ यू हैव नॉट लुकड एट द एंटायर स्पैन ऑफ हिज पेशेंस If you have looked only at his last five six attempts, then you will say lucky chap. See how lucky he is. He has just stumbled upon something so beautiful. He is very very lucky. We do not know the complete picture. In fact, we can never know the complete picture. even if you feel that you have been lucky with respect to something there is a story behind it and it might so happen that due to sheer probability you may get something in the first attempt due to pure luck even if it comes to you due to pure luck and therefore very easily it will not remain with you if you do not work hard enough first of all you need to work hard to give luck some luck you have to give luck a chance to come to you are you getting it you have to give luck some chance to come to you otherwise luck will keep waiting luck will keep waiting luck demands of you that you do some work go to the basics please luck means that you are getting something unexpected and big right that's what you call as being lucky correct it was big and it was unexpected and it happened and you say oh i am so lucky so the big thing has already happened if the big thing has already happened you at least do some small thing and that small thing is called hard work that small thing is called hard work otherwise luck keeps waiting at the door luck says i have come from afar to you and i am waiting at the door you at least get up from your chair and unbolt the door open the door at least this much of work is required to benefit even from luck therefore keep working hard do not wait for luck you could even say and listen to this carefully that luck comes compulsorily to those who do not wait for it you can you can force luck to come to you by the sheer dint of your labor you can force luck you may you can you can tell him i am working so hard that you will have to come to me and you could take examples from various fields you could take examples from the field of science and technology you could take examples from the field of sports or you could take examples from the field of spirituality we just took the example of edison now think of all the old stories that you hear and we never take those stories seriously and we feel there is not much in them but let's go back to those old religious stories we hear that a fellow worshiped god on the banks of river ganga 
for many, many long years. And then God appeared in front of him and God said, okay, so what do you want? And he said, this is what I want. And his wish was granted. Right? We have heard of such stories. Even here, please see what is happening. God represents luck. And the hard work and the austerity and the penance that this fellow is doing has forced even God to come down. Even God is prepared to come down to you provided you say, I am waiting stubbornly for you and I am prepared to pay the price. If you do not come down for 10 years, I will stay put for 10 years. I am going nowhere. I am determined that I want you. And then the stories say that even God has to agree to you. If even God has to agree to you, who can then deny you? Hmm? So force luck. Don't wait for luck. Force luck. You wait for it, it insults you. You force it by continuing to work, work and work, it respects you. Don't be insulted by luck.